हेलो फ्रेंड्स सतीश तिवारी हियर फ्रॉम इथिकल हैकिंग टीचर सेंटर जयपुर और टुडे वी आर गोइंग टू वॉच और वी आर गोइंग टू क्रिएट ए लैब हाउ टू कॉन्फ़िगर सेल टावर यूजिंग 3G एंड 4G नेटवर्क ओके सो एक्चुअली वी आर गोइंग टू कॉन्फ़िगर 3G एंड 4G नेटवर्क आई विल शो यू हाउ सेल टावर वर्क हाउ सेंट्रल सर्वर वर्क हाउ टू कॉन्फ़िगर देम टू वर्क विथ योर मोबाइल डिवाइसेस सो फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल आई एम दिस इज पैकेट रेसर यू कैन सी and in this packet tracer i am going to take few uh, smartphones okay so i am taking 1 2 3 4 4 how over a smartphone uh, the number does not matter you can take according to your uh, screen size okay so i have taken four i have just taken four uh, smartphones now the second option we are going to do is we are going to take a central server so let me go to the router go to the wireless router and here you can see cd server that is central office server and then we are going to take a cell tower okay so in this is cell tower now this smartphone will be connected with this cell tower you can see this this smartphone has been connected with this cell tower but this is a smartphone yet not connected with our this central tower is not yet connected with our uh, central office server okay so now our task is to connect the cell tower with our central office server and how to do that so let's let's try to do that let me first arrange the smartphones this is our cell tower now i want to connect the cell tower with this central office server so i will just go to central office server go to services go to this option you can see you go when you go to services you first go to configure okay first go to configure then go to cell tower here you can see the ip address i am giving the ip address 192.168.1.1 okay you also give the same one once you give this ip address go to services and go to services now you can uh, you can decide from where you want to assign the ip address start the ip address from 100 or 50 or whatever so let me start the ip address from 10 okay and click on save now you can see the maximum number of users i have allowed 50 it means total 50 users can connect with this one okay so i have configured the central office server but yet this is not central office server and cell tower is not connected now how to connect them go to cell tower and here you have to make some certain changes you can see by default it is like wireless network and i don't need this one i need to connect this with 3g and 4g network so i will remove this one and then i will click here on this 3g and 4g network and drag and drop this option here and done once you done it okay so let me zoom in for you you have to use this one remember you have to use this one okay i have selected this from here 3g and 4g network and done it now once i done it done it you can see this uh, the say office central office server has been connected with the cell tower the central office server is connected with the cell tower now our cell tower is ready and our smartphone will uh, get the ip address with the central office server the central tower is just a mediator just receive the uh, receive the signal and transmit the signal okay so now you can go to the smartphone go to config go to 3g and 4g cell one and you can see here ip address 192.168.1.0 if you refresh it will get a different ip address okay so you can see all these machines getting the ip address go to config go to 3g 4g cells and here it is go to config here it is everyone is getting an ip address and that's what we want we want every machine to get an ip address done everyone is getting an ip address let's check the ping whether they are able to communicate with each other or not so just ping and first failed it's okay you can try again and it will be successful okay you can see it's successful from source to destination a smartphone 3 and if you want to see this in simulation mode you can also see this in simulation mode packet from central office server goes to cell tower and then the cell tower send that packet to the smartphone and the smartphone which i sent that will only receive this packet and the rest uh, smartphone will uh, denied that these packets are not there okay and you can see the acknowledgement coming from a smartphone 3 uh, to the cell tower and the cell tower is send the acknowledgement to the central office server and in this way the communication happened
I hope you understand this lab and if you have any doubt regarding this uh, configuration, you can ask me through the comment section. Thank you. Thank you for watching.